Hello and welcome to Blue Average Gaming. I'm your host, the Blue Average Gamer. Today we will be playing Pokemon Solar Light. Um, yeah, let's just go ahead and hop right into that. There's the music for you. It's loud. Let's go ahead there. One more fonts do not exist. And blah, 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 blah. If you've ever played any of the um, fan-made Pokemon games or the Fakemon games, they all seem to have this. I don't know why. I've never put the other things in. Let's go ahead and start a new game. Hello, how are you? Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Professor Pinewood. Um, people call me the Pokemon Professor. If you need help, don't hesitate to ask. Um, sure, let's go over the controls real quick, because I've, I've never played one of these fully. Okay, he's probably... I'm just going to... He's going to talk to people. To exit. Okay, so C is to do things. X is to exit. Z is to... Down while walking to run. Man. Move the character, also used to scroll through list. Used to confirm a choice. Okay, so C can confirm a choice. Talk to people. X is used to exit a choice mode. Da, da, da. Z is used to run. Press and use to register key item. Sounds great. Adventure. Well, then further ado. You're about to enter a world where you'll embark on a grand adventure of your own. <laughs> Speak to people and check things where you go. Be it it's in towns, roads, or caverns. Get information, hints from every possible. Blah, blah, blah. Overcome challenges and solve mysteries. Same thing that you've heard in every other Pokemon game from every other tree named human being. Uh, it's not solely about becoming powerful. Travels will help you learn time to spend. Blah, 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 blah. If you need help, don't hesitate to ask. I don't want. <sighs> no info needed. Ooh, what is that? It's so cute and tiny. It looks like a milk dud with teeth, which sounds sounds terrifying. But in actuality, it's a very cute little beaver-looking Pokemon thing. Oh, I really like those models. That's really cool. Um, are you a boy or a girl? I am a boy. Say your name was. My name is. Oh, I have to, I can't type. I have to put it. Farts. Okay. So you're farts. <laughs> yes, I am. Are you ready? Your own Pokemon story is about to unfold. You'll face fun times and tough challenges. A world of dreams and adventures. But Pokemon awaits you. Let's go. And we're already on. We're already going. We're already getting to our adventure. Oh, whoa. That's interesting. That's not how most Pokemon games start. Welcome to our show battle in the Rikoto League Village. Today it's a battle between two famous gym leaders of our beautiful region. On the left side it's Wei, the gym leader of Wei Tide City. On the right side it's the wonderful Electra, the gym leader of Rust Bolt, which I would assume is electric. Are the trainers ready to battle? Yes, of course. Absolutely. Then let's the battle begins. Man, this is in interesting. Oh, uh, it's intense. Are we gonna see the Pokemon? Oh, okay. I guess not. Not yet. Farts! Didn't you hear me call you? Anyone <laughs> watching Pokemon Battles? Uh, uh. Rodney's downstairs waiting for- I'm guessing Rodney is my rival or friend or something. Can I run yet? I can't run yet. Rodney. Farts! About time you guys- I, I don't know why I named my character that. <laughs> I did and I, I have no regrets. I have no regrets. So bummed that's his name. Oh, this guy actually has a father. Okay. That's different from the Pokemon game. I mean, I think the only one where he actually does have a dad is um, the Hoenn region. In um, Sapphire, Emerald, and Ruby. And he's a gym leader, so he's not even at home. Sure, let's go on an adventure. It's Sultry Town. I can't wait, follow me! Here we go. The beginning, I always, I, oh, I never liked the beginning. Oh, that's a really cool lab. I never liked the beginning because um, it's just so much running back and forth. Like, here's, you gotta go find the Pokemon. Pokemon, they give you this. Go get the parcel, take the parcel to whoever it is and whatever. Let me tell you something first. As you know, I'm a professor, but you probably don't know this. I'm studying the environments in which Pokemon live, like to live, how they survive, 
and how they grow and evolve in those conditions. That sounds cool. It's very exciting to see where Pokemon live. This is why I'm entrusting you two with this. Is it a Pokedex? I'm in this machine in three Pokeballs. Ah, I'm gonna get my Pokemon. Ha! Ah! Choose whichever one you want. I think I'm going to choose... I always tend to choose the one that no one picks. I usually don't pick fire, because everyone picks fire. So I usually pick water or grass. Normally, I'll pick water. Because I don't like grass. Do you want Salatad? Do you want Perlet? It's a very generic, uh, fakey one. That one looks just like Churchwig. I'm gonna go with the water one. He looks a little off, like a little weird. But I like him. Salatad. Farts obtain Salatad. I'm not gonna give him a nickname, because I want to remember that he is a Salatad. <clears throat> and if I give him a nickname, I'm gonna completely forget. Haha, <laughs> now you're gonna get the, the weird grass Pokemon that looks like... Just a ripoff of a different Pokemon. <laughs> Parts received a Pokedex. This is the Pokedex. It records all the Pokemons you see and capture. Me in my studies on where Pokemon like to live. Thanks, Professor Pinewood. I'm so happy right now. This is awesome. I'm going to go and start my journey. There he goes. Look at him go. Do you have anything else to tell me? I would love to start my journey. I would love... I like seeing all the fake Pokemon. Normally, games like this, they'll have a sheet where you can go to on like their wiki or something. Where you can go and see... Oh, could you go to Mossy Town? Okay. I have to go pick up something as usual. But, um, they'll usually have, like, a page where you can go and see all their Pokemon. I didn't want to check it because I want to see them in-game. I want to I wanna learn about these Pokemon and see everything that they do in-game. Rather than, uh, than learning about them first. Are you going to talk to me? Are you going to battle me? Again, this is, like, the most monotonous thing at the very beginning. Because it's just all the same stuff as always. I was so excited, I almost forgot. How about our first battle? We battled each other. Awesome. We are both new to battling, but sure, uh, hard, hard, sure try hardest. Rodney. A lot of stuff here looks really good. It's really reminiscent of uh, the original Ruby, Sapphire, and Emerald. Her over. Get over here! Okay, let's fight. Use pound. I'm gonna kill this guy quick. Oh, uh, don't do this. Oh no. I might lose. I might lose. Are you serious? This is like a genuinely like good fight. Could quit. No. What? What? I'm so angry. How does that make any sense? Usually in other games, they'll at least use like one, like, oh, I'm going to use a growl, or I'm going to use something else, some sort of status weakener, and then I can use that one attack to get through. <laughs> but his was so much stronger against mine. That is so unbalanced. I'm so angry. I'm so upset. Okay, whatever. That's fine, because I'm going to become the Pokemon champion, and I'm going to beat you all the time, every day of my life. Sit outside your house. They're like, where's the champion? He's over at Rodney's house again. Just kicking his door in, finding his family, dating his mom. One. Route one. I'm so upset. I want to see some of the wild Pokemon before I fight anyone. Ooh, I get a wild Pokemon. Ooh, I wonder if it's that beaver thing from the beginning. I think it was pretty cool. Ooh, that's cool. It's like a bird. Almost like a pit of. But cheap. Alright, let's pound. Good. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha. Look at that. I'm I'm still good. I still got it. I gained 13 EXPs. I'm gonna try to fight this guy. I'm not feeling it now that I lost to my, my rival.
Oh, he doesn't even want to battle me. Okay. That's fine. I guess I'm just gonna move on ahead. And keep on moving. Keep on going. That guy looks like he wants to battle. Alright, let's battle then, pal. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you stand next to this weird tree. Okay. I guess not. Hey, do you know about this kind of tree on my left? It's a headbutt tree. Let's move headbutt and use it on this tree. It's possible that a Pokemon will fall down and attack you. Why would I want that? Why would anyone in the real world want that? Hey, headbutt this tree and a Pokemon will come down. It'll attack you. It'll try to kill you. That thing's pretty cool. Elect Electrator? I wish I had a Pokeball. I don't want to capture that guy. Just tail whip. Okay, so it has defense went down, whatever. He's pound. E. He's. I was going to say no critical hits yet, but I guess that counts as one, right? Um, let's open up my bag. <laughs> Farts. Potion. Use. Not yet. Not yet. I'm gonna avoid you for now, because I want to go heal up first. Elecritter? Or, uh, Budgeep? Who's it gonna be? Budgeep. I like Budgeep. Pretty cool. Little zebra bird. I mean, yeah, I say he looks like Pidove, but... You know, what are you gonna do? He's... Decent Pokemon. He's an a-hole. Hey! Blaze it. With my HP. See that? Oh, and it's a girl. Usually, um, in the Pokemon games... I think that it's same gender, is whatever gender your character is, is the same gender that your starter is. So that is something else that's interesting. That mine is a... is a female character, or a female Pokemon. Which normally does not happen. Oh really? I got stuff in the last square? I hate when that happens. I hate when that happens in normal Pokemon games, because I already know about all the Pokemon. But in this one I'm fairly excited, because maybe it'll be something new. It is something new! Hamstar! Oh, it's a hamster! I'm assuming. I like that. That's cool. Let's use Bubble. I hope I use Pound on accident. Pound. Use Bubble. Whoa! Nice! I'm using Bubble more often. I'm using Bubble a lot more often. Nice. Okay, end of Route 1. Where am I? Ooh, there's a Pokemon gym here. <coughs> or is that a Pokemon Center? Oh, it's a Pokemon Center. That's what PC stands for. Hello there, dude. You are a new trainer, aren't you? Do you know about this building behind me? It's a Pokemon Center, a very important building for trainers. I can't skip any of this dialogue. I'm not liking this game so far. I'm not really digging this whole tour thing. Follow me, young trainer. I wish they would have asked, like, do you know about all this or no? Huh, this is the most important place in the Pokemon Center, the healing station. Just give your Pokemon the nurse can, she will heal for you. She can. This is the computer with this, you can send your Pokemon or item to another computer. Pokemon storage system, you can send your Pokemon to Professor Pinewood. Pinewood? Why wouldn't it just be Professor Pine? Because they don't have like Oakwood or anything like that. They just have, their name is the tree. Oh, cool! You can get little quests. I wish they would implement that in Pokemon, because that would make the game a lot more fun, a lot longer. Which would make it so at the end you're not just like, I gotta go find something to do, gotta go catch all the Pokemon, or whatever. It would make it a lot more fun. Okay, so let's go here. How may I serve you? I would like to buy Pokeballs. I'm gonna buy five. That way I can get a nice, good team. Some potions, certainly how many you like. Let's do three. 
yeah, it'll be fine. And perfect. Thanks so much. Awesome. And my Pokemon's pretty much fully healed because I use that potion on them, so I'm not going to worry about that. Someone here needs to give me something for the professor, I think. In Moss something town. Is this Moss something town? If I leave and come back, it should tell me. Route 1. Mossy town. Yes. Mossy town. Old man, do you have something for me? Oops, I don't want to talk to you again. I'm coming in. Do you have something for me? Okay, I'm just gonna stand here and ha! Oh, that's your mom. That's cool. People love little families and stuff. I'm guessing you don't have something for me to take to Professor Pinewood. I always thought it'd be cool if the the professor's assistant had a name like a fungus or something. Like you have the, you have the tree and then you have the fungus. I think that'd be interesting. Oh, this person seems to. And just walking into other people's houses. A uh, good point. That makes me feel like I should go look through your trash. I found a full heal. Sorry, but you brought this upon yourself. I'm taking your things and I'm leaving. Bye. <coughs> oh man, who are you? And that is some crazy hair. You are farts? You came to get me? Thanks! I totally knew I forgot something today, silly me. Oh, I better go get my Pokemon. Oh, that's it? Do I have to go back? I don't have to go back? Hey, Kira, wait a second. Oh, farts. Surprise, I know your name. Well, I'm a good friend of your mom, and she just called me to say that you were on your way to tell Kira about her Pokemon. I see you. She is already gone. The Gengi. But your mother also told me to tell you she has something for you. You should go back home and see what it is. Uh, I don't want to do that. It's running shoes, but I want the running shoes now. You couldn't just give me the running shoes? What is this, the winner? Oh, that's how I can go back. What's over here? Ooh, some little hidden stuff. I found one potion. Ha ha ha. Okay, now let's go. Am I wearing a helmet? What is that thing? It it looks kind of like a beanie in the picture, but from here it just looks like a helmet. Am I wearing a helmet? What is this? Is this tree important? Those two arrows are pointing at that tree. I don't know what that means. Okay, so mom has running shoes for me. I think this is my house. <coughs> yes, there's my mom and my father. Fart, I see you got my message. Well, your father and I have a gift for you. Fart, receive the running shoes. Oh, if you get to where you need to go faster. I have a gift for you too. This is a pokey gear. It contains a map of the Rakota region. <coughs> I don't care. That's like the most useless thing. Oh man, I am so fast. It's like the speed of the bike. <laughs> you, where's the guy? Mm. I don't want to talk to you again. Dang it. Okay. Uh, I keep doing this. No. Oh. Well, no. Can't worry. Okay. Thanks. I appreciate your help. Bye. Let me guess. I'm gonna run into Team Something on the way back to the city, right? <laughs> Professor Pinewood, Mutton Chops. I forgot to give you these obtained Pokeballs. I just bought Pokeballs, dude. I should have known. I mean, there's the same pattern in all of the games, and I should have known. I really should have known <laughs> to not buy Pokeballs because I'd get some anyway. But now you can catch twice as many Pokemon. Whatever. 
It should have not let me buy Pokeballs. I was so surprised that it let me buy Pokeballs when I went to town. It should have not let me. Because I was really surprised and I was like, oh, I guess I'm not going to get Pokeballs later because I probably would have had them by now. Why do I walk in like some sort of chump? Oh, please be that electric one, that little electric fox thing. At like a level three. Dreams would come true if that's what it was. Oh, this one's blue. It's because it's the boy. Hope I'm not missing out on a... I'm gonna fight him. On a, on a shiny. I guess the boys are blue and the females are pink. I didn't pay attention earlier. Hey, level 7. You're such a good guy, Salutad. I wish you looked just a little cooler. I mean... If dreams could come true. I think the blue one had something on its head, too. They're like quails, I'm guessing. Bubble. Ow, my face. Let's do another bubble. I'm not one to ever use status, not status change, but yeah, like the attack and defense status change attacks. I don't know why, I just don't. I think it's easier just to go headlong into it. I probably should just use pound on that last one. Ugh, come on, are you serious? These stupid bud jeeps, they're everywhere. Apparently, most they're like... Five females to one male, too. Should I just catch it? I should just catch it. I hate getting that the starter bird Pokemon, though, because the starter bird Pokemon always sucks in comparison to, like, the next bird Pokemon you get. But it seems that this game's breaking some rules, though, too, so... I don't know. I do not know. So this time, I'll just use... I'll just use Pound. There we go. 29? <coughs> Hot dang. I don't have any other Pokemon I want to battle yet. <coughs> wow, that's a really cool, like, zoom thing. Okay, so it's not a shiny, it's just a boy. Good. I don't know why I felt like since it's blue, bubble would be less effective on it. Ooh, it's a critical hit. <laughs> ha ha! Level 8. Dude, you're gonna be like, uh, a whatever it is in no time. Whatever it is you turn into, you're gonna be a great one. No time at all. Let's heal up right quick. Hello and welcome to Pokemon Center. We restore your tired Pokemon to full health. Would you like to rest your Pokemon? Yes, I would. That's why I came in here. Why on earth would I come in here otherwise? Thank you for waiting. Restore your Pokemon to full health. We hope to see you again. Why? You hope that my Pokemon get injured. That's real nice. I appreciate that. We hope that something horrible happens that you have to come and see us again. That'd be really nice. That'd be really cool. Well, that's that same water spot that they have in every Pokemon game that I can't explore till later. That's at the beginning of the game. Whoa. Hello there. Hello, farts. Thanks for coming to get me. I can't believe I almost forgot about getting my first Pokemon. How about a battle? It could be fun. This is be my first trainer battle, so please don't be whatever it is. Kira. Okay, Kira. Go ahead and send out your fire Pokemon, and I'll send out my water Pokemon. And this will be quick. I accidentally hit pound. Bubble. How dare you scratch me? Bubble him. Bubble him. Kill him instantly. Ooh. I'm about to go to level 9, hopefully. Probably not. Probably do get really close, but I probably won't go to level 9. I enjoyed it. So happy for you. So happy that you had a great time. 
Bloop, bloop, bloop. Hey, thanks for healing my Pokemon that took hardly any damage. Wait, did you just go in? Oh, okay. I was like, wait, hold on. Where did you go? I'm gonna go up to the road less traveled. Oh, I gotta use cut on that little pseudo wudo. Oh, what are you? Ooh, a stick it. I do love bug bug Pokemon. I'm gonna go ahead and get this guy. I hope it's a bug Pokemon. Might not be. Hopefully this is the one like the butterfly one in every game. How many Pokeballs do I have now? Ten? Yeah, I have ten. Use a Pokeball. Oh. 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 Hey, my first official caught Pokemon. Stick it. Stick it. Welcome to the team. Welcome to the crew. So happy to have you aboard. I don't want to give you a name. Because again, if I give him a name, I'm going to forget what his real Pokemon name is. I want that electric one that I saw. I guess it was like a rare occurrence. I haven't seen it since. This guy's cool. I like him. One of my favorites, Hamstar. I'm going to catch Hamstar. I like Hamstar. <laughs> oh, it's one of those ones. They clearly did some research on getting these Pokemon into like the realms that they're supposed to be in. Like the one that, that uses defense moves to bring up its defense really high. I wonder if I'll get EXP for catching Pokemon. Like in the newer games. Yay! Hamstar! I'm so happy I got Hamstar. I like that guy. <laughs> Such a cool little dude. I know that he's going to become overrated, but he might be a really good HM carrier. So, I'll just keep him. Cool guy. Great guy. Highly recommend. Okay, this is about to be my first trainer battle. Let's look at my Pokemon real quick. Ah, okay. Let's use up some of those potions. Oh, I keep, pulling the wrong, I keep pulling the wrong button. Okay, there we go. Okay, pal. Let's do this. First official trainer battle. I should have caught the bird Pokemon. I read this thing that the reason there are bug catchers in the game is because the guy who invented Pokemon loved catching bugs as a kid. And, and, and when he grew up, that was his thing. Was He was like, I'm going to put bug catchers in here because bug catchers are something that exists. I know because I was one. Oh, it's grass type. Ooh. Things are not going well for me here. Oh, no. Uh, no, no. Okay. Pound. Kill. Kill. Oh, thank God. Thank God. 103. Dang. Okay. I learned acid. My first official trainer match. Hopefully it's a good Pokemon. So I got... Ooh, what are you? Lavin Seed? I don't care for Lavin Seed. But I will use you to train. Hamstar. Oh, he has a little star in his back. Pound. Oh, this is going to be a long match. I like Hamstar. Favorite Pokemon. Personal fave. I really want to do some research into these Pokemon and, like, what's the best used use for them. You know? But, like, what Hamstar evolves into. 
all that good stuff, but I don't want, I don't want to learn about other Pokemon existing. I would rather just see them in the wild. Nice! Good job, Hamstar! Good job, man. Well, I think that's going to be it. Um, thank you for watching me play Pokemon Solar Light and Lunar Dark Demo 4.0. Really fun game. I think I'm going to continue to play it, just kind of see where it goes. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching. Thanks for checking out the channel. Thank you for liking, subscribing, and commenting. I appreciate you as a human being. You the best, and bye!